Welcome back to Ben's Pesto channel. My girlfriend and I were doing some gardening and she found a couple of worms and I decided to, hey, throw one in and give one to a little Rocky over here. And uh, the worm was not chopped up as you can see. It was a little bit bigger than Rocky. It was actually probably just about as long as he is. And uh, over the last couple minutes he has struggled to eat this whole thing but he has not dropped it once. And he's just been going crazy over this little worm, so I'm going to let you uh, check this out for a minute and hopefully see him devour the rest of the worm, which is probably still about half as long as he is, and uh, still alive. So he's really having a good time going crazy on this worm, uh, and little Adrian, I put in uh, some pieces of chopped up worm for her, uh, the female Pistogramma McMaster eye in here, and she went crazy on those as well. But uh, she's just a little too small to be aggressive with these larger worms. I guess they're still pretty, pretty small worms, but to a small Pistogramma McMaster eye, uh, it's a pretty big worm. So this is a first for me. Uh, I used to feed my Oscars worms, and they loved it. Usually, when you're feeding your fish worms, you want to squeeze them out. You want to squeeze all the poop and all the dirt out because you just don't want all that extra crap uh, in your tank and uh, especially also in your fish. So it's good to feed your fish worms every once in a while but not all the time. You obviously, you probably want to do like a pellet diet. Uh, live food is great. I've been trying to do a little bit more live food to encourage these guys to breed since they just bred for the first time together. Oh, we just dropped the worm and he's back at it right on. Uh, but the female ate all of the eggs, which is unfortunate, but that was their first time breeding, and, uh, you know, these things happen. So, thank you for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, tell me what you guys feed your fish. If you guys feed your fish any sort of live food that you usually don't find at the pet store. So, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you on the next video.